All right, everybody. So uh, we just did a grammar translation style lesson. You've uh, studied the vocabulary, you studied the grammar, and you've translated a passage from Wikipedia. Um, I'd like to discuss positive points and negative points about this method. Let's begin with the positive points. Uh, what's good about this grammar translation method for studying language? Okay. Anybody? Easy to learn. Easy to learn vocabulary for beginners. Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, we focus so much on the vocabulary and translation of vocabulary. So for for beginners, yeah, okay, it's a good, it's easy starting point. Okay. Thank you. Other people? Anything else? Okay. Yeah, I think this is good for past self to learn. Yeah. Something. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Language. As a first step. Yeah. First okay, step. it could be a good first step. All right. Thank you. Did you find anything else positive about this style? One key point about grammar translation is that it's done in the native language of the learners. Right? So yeah. Definitely, it's uh, it's easy on the beginner because it's done in their language. Yeah. All right. Uh, now let's switch to negative points. What did you find negative about this style? It yes. Go ahead. Not, um, it is not natural. It's not natural. Natural seven. Yeah, okay, the language produced was not natural. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Why? You translate it. Uh, if I read Japanese and uh, if I have to translate it into English, well, first I have to uh, re read uh, Japanese and then uh, I have to take each word and check the meaning of the this uh, into uh, uh, meaning of this it's so uh, frustrated okay. but uh, my desire is to understand the whole meanings mm. so I have to take as uh, many steps mm. Mm. to get to the goal mm. so I'm so frustrated I see okay all right thank you any other negative points It's difficult to describe accurate meaning. Yeah, grammar translation, a big focus on grammar translation method, though, is accuracy. But it's difficult to be accurate. Okay? Yeah, this purpose of this method is to understand grammar and words. Uh, this is a good method, but uh, if this purpose of this method is to uh, understand the full meaning of this sentence, uh, this method is bad uh, to understand it. Uh, okay, okay uh, go ahead. Actually, I'm interested in this uh, article mm. because uh, this article is interesting for me because I'm classic of the moon. Mm. So I wanted to get the meaning of this sentence, but this method uh, makes us the focus on grammar, uh, not uh, meaning of this sentence. So mm. I think this method uh, couldn't make uh, my emotion. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, it is good to uh, uh, some people, mm. like winners, mm. but uh, switching puzzles mm. is just a puzzle. It's just a puzzle. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's just, yeah, that's a good deep. point.